Geek Tonight, what's poppin'? It's Adonis. We are back for another Black Clover reaction. Smell me. So if you want to stay geeked, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss the next one. Now, as usual, thank you guys so much for all the support. Welcome to all the new Geek Tonight's that have been knighted over the past 24 hours. Welcome. Let me know you guys are brand new with the hashtag FreshFam in the comments so I can thank you guys personally. Also, we are on our way to 300K, man. If you haven't joined the wave, join the movement, man. We would love to have you here. Smash that subscribe button. Join the community here, man. We are growing so fast, and I appreciate all you guys that have come on board the past week. It's been so crazy to see, so thank you guys so much. And also, everybody that's been helping the channel grow with the comments, the likes, and the shares, thank you guys so much. And obviously, the intro saying, so if you guys want me to say something funny at the beginning of the next reaction, leave that hashtag intro saying in the comments and tell me something funny to say and I might pick yours. Other than that, man, we're in it for the Black Clover 127 reaction. We're starting this new arc, or I think some people say it's like a, it's like a, it's not canon, but it's canon arc, whatever. We're gonna get into it anyways. If you guys wanna catch this unedited, link in the description box for the Patreon. Let's get into this, bro. I'm super excited. This Black Clover swag is, you know, it's one of my faves throughout the week. One of my faves. <laughs> <laughs> My best friend Asta. Bro, you know what's crazy is <laughs> it's so funny. It's not funny, but it's funny at the same time. Like he really thinks Asta's his best friend, right? Which is fine. But I don't know if Asta thinks he <laughs> he's his best friend. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, damn, bro. Like, it's like, it's awesome and sad at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, look, the only person that's riding behind me is Mari. <laughs> is that so interesting their whole situation was we're gonna curse people and get paid for it bro what <laughs> <laughs> the curse part doesn't bother you just because you don't know the person. <laughs> they all got the same eyes, bro. <laughs> My question is, why are they all standing in the same room? Like, why are they? How do they all at the same time at the door? <laughs> the grandma didn't say nothing. She said, <laughs> Nah. Bro, this is hilarious. <clears throat> Yo, it's real talk. They're like the Adams family. <clears throat> That's what they remind me of right now. I think we can become best friends. <laughs> he wants to be, his family all want to be best friends with somebody, bro. <laughs> First of all, bro, her face right now is the most we've ever seen her face emote ever, ever. The fear. Huh. Mm -hmm. 
実はいかもしれないけど何をしてでも助けたい仲間が出てきたんだ<笑>その仲間のために剣術の呪い悪魔について教えてくれ<笑><笑>なあ Oh, chill, sure. Man, this is really like on some Adam's family shit. Humans' lives die so easily. What does that mean? He's like, as well as your friends. So, what is he suggesting? That Gordon's not human? That's actually super tight. It's like usually, it's like in real life, the best cops were criminals. And vice versa, the best criminals are cops. You know what I'm saying? It's like, well, shit,、uh, I know how this works, so I could work the system. You know what I mean? Hey! Hmm. You're really aggressive. Hi! Hmm. Oh, shit, bro. Okay, so there is something. This is interesting. So her mom was killed by something that they're unfamiliar with. One. Two. His brother, the brother, it seemed, told the story, or they told the story to her. So it's almost like they're protecting her. Like, look, it's your fault that she died. But really, it was because of something else. Somebody put a curse on her of some sort. And they don't want that to happen to anybody else in the family. It's what it seems like. So they made up the story, made her feel some kind of way about herself killing her mom. But it was also to protect her. That's what it seems like is going on right now. Mm. This is tight. She's like, you'll get cursed, at least in this world. But in my dream world, I got all control of what's going on in here, bro. So tight. <laughs> Yo, so it's like she's seeing like all of her fantasies, all of her thoughts. That's what it seems like it's doing right now.、Like、it's going through her mind of like how she feels about stuff. <laughs> He's like, well, he's really on your mind right now. See, he didn't want to put her in danger. He's like, Look, I was, I said what I needed to say to protect your life. 
as much as it ruined a lot of your life because you felt incompetent, you felt, you know what I'm saying? You felt like you killed the family, essentially. Like, man, that's the lesser of two evils, I guess. Megikura. Maybe me crazy if that was a demon that's inside of Asta's shit. That'd be crazy. That's a candle. Those are candles. <laughs> That's tight. Gordon? So it's either so it's either Gordon or it's Asta. Mm. I wonder if it's the the wager dude. Hmm. Oh, chill. Chill. So this is dope. So they can kind of see on a map based off of that mana. Okay, there's some curse stuff going on over here. That's actually really dope because it gives them like a GPS situation and not just hunting random spots. Um, I feel I feel like what's in their hideout though is something that they haven't encountered yet. Or it could have something to do with Asta. That'd be cool. Um, it could have something to do with the base itself. Uh, but there's something, uh, I feel like what they're doing right now is showing uh, not not arcs, but story arcs. Like, okay, these are places that we're going to visit where things are going to happen. We also know the Heart Kingdom has something massive there. He did say the further away it goes, the less accurate it means. So it couldn't, it could mean that even though there's a big thing there, it could be multiple things there. It could, it doesn't necessarily mean it's one curse. It could be plenty of curses there. Um, so that's interesting as well. So I'm glad that there is some kind of, danger i guess ahead for them um a lot of uncertainty which is dope so I, I dig that quite a bit um noelle's situation is the most interesting i feel like right now and i like how they're how they're linking her mom's death to the curses to the devils obviously ass is already attached to that whole situation as well so there could be something along the lines of all these things being connected um which is very interesting um yeah i'm actually really excited to see what how they bring these things together because there there seems like there's threads that are similar enough to be you know going in the same direction and there's other things it's like okay is it an, a, a is it a, a strategy of multiple things going on or is this one person that has set all these things in motion you know what i mean very interesting um episode itself was pretty cool it it was definitely a slower pace episode but was definitely still moving the story forward in what we are trying to do as far as getting that knowledge about the devil. So I was actually pretty cool about the episode. What did you guys think about this? Let me know in the comments. If you guys want to catch this unedited, a link in the description box for the Patreon. And if you haven't joined the wave yet, we would love to have you over here, man. Smash that subscribe button. Also hit that bell since no YouTube is not notifying people properly, especially during this time right now. So hit that bell and make sure you guys allow those notifications to come in. I upload damn near daily, so I wouldn't want you guys to miss that stuff. And if you want to check my previous Black Clover reaction, that link will be right here to the side. All right, guys. Until next time. Stay geeked.